What's up, everybody? This is Afro Joe coming to you. Uh, no, I know I just did two more videos the, the other day, uh, but I'm doing this video for a friend of mine. His name is Mindhack, Mindhacker, and he's a good friend of mine because uh, me and him are good friends on SL Second Life. And he gave me a link, one a uh, video link to one of his video, and I was watching it. And as I was watching it, this guy had Skype with my friend Mindhacker Mindhacker and the duck and this guy that's been Skyping my friend sitting up there saying I'm gonna hack you I'm gonna get my friend to hack you I'm a troll I've been a black guy since 2005 I'm gonna hack you. he's been saying this to my my homeboy and his name is Create Create Creator actually and I was sitting there thinking, I said, dude, why would you out yourself like that? Why would you sit up there and tell everybody that you're a troll? Why would you out yourself like that? I ain't never in my life seen a person. Actually, he showed, my friend Minecraft shows a, a, where he's saying all this because it's in a video and I watched it. And I'm sitting there I say, why would you out yourself? If you're a troll... You wouldn't out yourself if you are, and he keeps on threatening my friend, mind hacker, that he was gonna hack his computer. Look, dude, if you don't say something, don't talk about it. Be about it. Do it. Just like like the old Nike commercial. Just do it. Don't sit there and talk, running your fucking mouth and making these things. I'm going to fucking hack your fucking computer. That's wasting time. If you say you was going to do something, you better do it. Don't sit up and say, oh, I'm going to kick your ass. You better, Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. That's how it is. Because as long as you sit up and say, I'm going to hack your computer, I'm going to hack your computer, nobody's going to believe you. See, one thing is you making your friends that you say, that you say, is teaching you how to hack and one thing is why do you out your friends out like that why if you got friends that know how to hack I wouldn't out them if they're teaching me cuz that's stupid I knew, like I did a video about this guy named acid burn he's on the he's on my CEO junior 2 channel and the funny thing about it is Acid Burn told people that he's got a guy teaching him how to hack and he taught everybody. Motherfucker is you stupid. Why would you tell a bunch of people that you're get that you're learning how to hack? It's like walking up to a police officer and told him that you just robbed a bank. You see what I'm saying? You want, it's like that. It's like you walking up to a bank uh, officer and telling him, say, hey, dude, I just robbed the bank. The money's in my car, and I'll see you later. Don't act like nothing's going to happen. That's stupidity. That is so stupid. Like, for real, though. For real, though. Like, why would you out yourself? This video is going to be everywhere, too, man. This, this video ain't going to stay in one spot. Because I'm a... Because this video is a video response to my homeboy Minecraft hacker video, uh, video. So it's gonna be on YouTube, Daily Motion, everywhere. So when you sit up here and trying to attack me because I spoke the truth that you're sitting up here playing these mind games, dude, you live in the UK. Why would you, like you live in the UK and he lives in the US? Why would you fuck with somebody in the UK? Why would you want to fuck with somebody in America just because over some bullshit? See what I'm saying? Oh, we used to be buds, man. We used to be buds. But I'm going to hack your ass. Look, this dude, that's childish, man. I know you, I know you, I know he's a little bit, he's probably older than me. If you're older than me, why are you acting like a fucking five-year-old? Cause I'm telling you, man, five-year-olds bullshit. Grown-ass men don't bullshit. Like I'm 27, I don't, I don't sit up there and say I'm gonna hack you and don't do it, man. Like for real, dog. 
For real though, man. You gotta you gotta get off your ass. I'm just saying, man. If you're gonna sit there and threaten somebody that you're gonna hack into that shit, do it. Don't say it. Do it. Do not do it. If you're gonna if you say you're gonna do it, you better do it. Because one thing is, nobody ain't gonna believe you. Ain't nobody gonna sit up there and have your back, because one thing is you're out in your friends too when you say that hacking shit, oh my friends will teach me how to hack, I'm just waiting for you to, f I'm just waiting for this guy, creator, to fuck up and give out his friends' names that'd be like the worst thing to do if he set up there and gave out his friends' names oh, this person this, this person, this, this person, this, this person all these people taught me how to hack stupid like you said, stupid, and then you sit up there and tell my friend that he changed his IP address. Which he didn't. Why would he want to change his IP address just because you got a dick in your ass? Well, what, what, are you mad because your old lady left your ass or something? I'm telling you, man, grow the fuck up and be a man. You fighting, you getting mad over petty shit, man. Petty shit, man. Petty, petty, petty. You just a petty ass motherfucker. If you all you gonna do is get mad at some person because your old lady left your ass. Don't sit up and say, cause you know motherfuckers, motherfuckers will lie and say, no, I broke up with her mother. And you got that anger in his voice, got that anger in his tone. Oh no, I left her motherfucker. You don't know what the hell you talking about. No, she left you, dude. She thought that your shit was so small and wrinkly and crusty as hell. She didn't want to touch it. Don't get mad because you can't get no pussy. First, don't get mad because you can't get no pussy, man. That's all it is. And then you see my homeboy, a picture on where he lives. And I actually seen the picture. Uh, I did not know my friend lives outside in the middle of nowhere. In the middle of nowhere. Come on, dude. There's no house in the middle of nowhere. There's nothing there but land. Nothing but land. I'm gonna put the video, my friend's video, in the description box and check it out. Cause everything you see in that video is the same thing I'm seeing it. Saying it. it's just, <laughs> I'm not repeating what he's saying. I'm just saying that my opinion that a grown ass man from the UK is going to fuck with somebody in the US that's pathetic, that's bullshit and he needs to grow the fuck up if your life is that fucking boring why would you want to sit there and start a fight over the fucking internet about you breaking up with your fucking girlfriend or your girlfriend breaking up with you I don't give a damn if she broke up with you you broke up with her it ain't my fucking business but if you're going to fuck with somebody just because she left you or because your friend told you about, some, about this about somebody don't get pissed off and get your butt hurt and all this and that and I'm serious man I ain't never in my in my life ever seen a grown ass man getting mad at somebody else because your old lady left you and you getting mad because and him for jack shit you threaten him I'm gonna hack you and then you sit up and you change your eye pictures oh man we was buddies how you go from talking shit to kissing ass? I'm for how do you go from talking shit to kiss ass? Because one thing is, I couldn't talk. I wouldn't be talking shit and kissing ass at the same time because that shit would kind of look bad on you. Oh, I'm going to fuck you up, man, but you still cool with me. Well, like, hold on, what? That's all it is, man. Stupid it is. I ain't going to sell for it. <laughs> this guy need more help than a motherfucker. Your life must be that fucking boring where you want to start a fight over the internet. If you was a real man, if you was a real man, you would have came over here and told him in his face. Tell him, told him in his face instead of threatening him over the, the computer. Oh, I forgot. The motherfucker's too chicken shit to even do it. He's too chicken shit to buy an airplane ticket, fly his ass over to where my friend is, and tell him in his motherfucking face. You want to hide behind a fucking computer screen and think you Billy Badass even though you ain't.
So you either grow the fuck up, and wake the fuck up, and be a fucking man, or you just shut the fuck up and sit over there and beat your meat to some damn dogs fucking your mama. Cause that's all it is, man. It's stupid. Stupid, man. I told people watch what you say and do over the internet, and motherfuckers don't listen. They wanna be all dumb, stupid, and mentally fucking retarded. They some re-reads and some DDDs. But I call him dick in the booty ass. That's what he is, creator. I know me and you ain't got no B, but I'm just putting out how you slipping up. You trying to be Billy Badass. Talking all this shit over the computer screen. You better, you be probably like, what about you? You talking shit. At least I get paid for it. At least I get paid for it. Then what you mean? Hey, I got AdSense, motherfucker. You too? I get AdSense. I don't know what you do. At least I get paid for this shit. You might be saying, what's up with all the rookies? Rookies are giving me. Hey, you can say rookies are giving me all you want. Why don't you fly your ass to California? Go up to a Skywalker Ranch. Walk your ass up to George Lucas and say, the rookie is a gimmick in front of him and his money and his wars. George Lucas made more money on his character than many other characters in Star Wars. He's making money. He made money off the rookie. So don't you sit there and throw that gimmick shit in my face. Because you ain't going to be no Billy Badass to me, man. Third, you can third me about, I'm going to keep my friends to hack your computer. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Why? That's one thing. Is that all you know how to do is ha uh, threaten people and trying to get your friends to do your dirty work? I know you're going to lie and go back to your friends and say, Oh, this motherfucker named Afro Joe. He said I was motherfucking. He said I was scared you good. He said you was confusing you, man. And you gonna lie to him, trying to get them to hack my shit because I told the truth. See, people get butt hurt when you tell the truth about them. They really do. I if somebody told me the truth about something, I'm gonna pay attention away. I'm gonna pay attention. I'm gonna, I ain't gonna get mad. Say, oh, thank you for telling me the truth. Uh, like I really wanted the truth. Don't wait till last minute to say something. It's just people can't handle the truth and they get all mad about it. And for create creator, don't you ever sit up here on the internet and talk all that bullshit saying you're going to do something. And you ain't going to do it. Second thing is, when you on a, when you on a site like YouTube, Facebook, Twitter and you out yourself like that don't you know that FBI is watching you don't you know that they collecting that evidence against you to have your ass arrested it doesn't matter if you in the UK or not don't you cause if you're threatening somebody and you're hacking somebody in the US and you're in the UK they can extradite your ass over here and prosecute you for hacking people in America. This is America's so they can do that. And you're dumb enough to sit up there and out yourself like that. I'm for real. Hackers don't never out themselves like that. They never do. Hackers don't ever ha out themselves. Trolls, they don't even out themselves, but this motherfucker said he was a troll. I'm a Wookiee. I, I, that's what I do. I tell people I'm a Wookiee. <laughs> but damn, dude, your life must be pathetic. You, you a pathetic piece of shit. Man, even a gay man won't even jack off to you, my dude. A gay man won't even jack off to you. You can make all the damn threats you want, but the truth, the truth, the facts, the facts. If you get butt hurt because I told the truth about you, and you get upset. Don't run up on me and say, oh, I'm going to hack your shit. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this to you. I'm going to do that to you. It shows everybody that you are a piece of shit and you don't know how to hang. And you are hope, ha lonely. You're hopeless. You ain't, you're hopeless. You can't get your dick off. You take Viagra just to get shit up. When I, if I get death threats and all like that, I get death threats on a daily basis, dude. Like, hang, like I actually had a pedophile threaten me. That's badass right there. I had somebody threaten to call the KKK on me. And hack is just a new one on the list. If you threaten to hack me, that's a new one on the list. You just look like the rest of the motherfuckers. Bark, bark with no bite. Bark with no bite. You 
just like that dog. You just like a dog on a chain. And you run out trying to grab, trying to bite on to somebody's leg. When you run it so fast and you getting closer and closer to that person, you jerk yourself, you choke yourself because the chain ain't long enough. You choke yourself. That's all you do, man. If you're going to hack him, if you're going to hack Mind Hacker, do it. Don't bullshit on the internet. Because if you do, people going to think you're a sissy, a sissy five motherfucker. They like taking an ass. Well, you, you probably like that dude in that video that got fucked by a horse and he died three days later. That's what it is. He's like the dude with the get fucked by a horse and die three days later. You probably wonder, how you know about that dude? Friends show me this damn video. And I, uh, 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 nasty. That's how it is, creator. That's all I got to say about you. you. You just need to grow up, dude. You just need to grow up. You need to get some professional help. You need to get professional help. And you need to stop getting people to fight your battle. Because <laughs> that's one thing. You need to stop telling people to fight your battles. Because one thing is, a man is not a man when you asking your friends to fight your battles. If you're going to be a real man, you fight your own battles. You fight your own battles instead of, oh, I'm going to call my friends and tell them to hack you. You don't do that, man. You don't do that because that tells me you're much as a punk than the next motherfucker in line. <coughs> If you can't do the shit yourself, then don't do it at all. If you can't do it yourself, don't do it at all. And this, and, and, and it's like it's, I ain't got beef with you, man. It's just the facts it's clearly out there, man. You, you're putting yourself out. You're acting like a fucking child. You're mad because your woman left you. Another thing is... uh. Another thing is, you're trying to get your friends to fight your battles, and that's really stupid, because you want your friends to go to jail, just like, see, you see, you want to get yourself locked up, because you're posting all the evidence that the FBI need to lock your ass up, and second thing is, you're trying to get your friends locked up without this, uh, my friends gonna hack your shit, my friends hacking your shit, you tell the FBI to, to come arrest you, even my friend, Hacker mind, uh, mind hacker is even showing the evidence. So you're really being stupid. But ladies and gentlemen, this has been Afro Joe. If you don't like what I got to say, you can kiss my ass and move on. If you like what I got to say, leave a video response or a comment. Follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my my channel, CeeLo Junior Two, CeeLo Junior Three. Cool, peace, and Afro grease. All right.